OK, so now I've changed the problem. It's still 1 over cos x equals 5, but we're now looking at the solutions between 360 and 720. Now, I would have gone all the way through this same process to get to the 78.5 and the 282 degrees um, in exactly the same way in order to solve this problem. The only difference is that neither of these are solutions that I want because neither are between 360 and 720. However, in order to get the ones between 360 and 720, if I remember that the period of cosine was 360, meaning the curve repeats itself every 360 degrees, that means that I can get the two solutions that I do want by adding 360 to both of those results. Effectively, it's like continuing the curve. OK, now to 720. The two solutions I want are that one and that one. OK, so I'm going to add 360 to both of them to get to those solutions. So 360 plus the 78.5 gets me to 438 degrees to 3 sig fig. And if I add 360 onto the 282, OK, so let's get back to that. So 282 plus the 360 gets me to 642. So the solutions I want are 438 degrees and 642 degrees to 3 sig fig. OK, so that's how I would solve this problem. I'd find the two solutions between, between 0 and 360 and add on uh, the period of the function in order to get to the solutions I need. And if the solutions I needed were between minus 360 and 0, I would do exactly the same trick but I would subtract 360 from both of these. Okay, So I just need to keep on adding on the period of the function, uh, either adding it on that way or subtracting it that way to get the solutions within the range that I'm looking for.